So for the CD generator, we have four coils of wire on the bottom CD, and then we have four neodymium magnets on the top CD. We've connected four coils in series, and then on the edges, we've connected thicker wire just for durability purposes. Hi, so this is the assembly to the CD generator that we have made. Here's the oscilloscope and here is the CD generator. First, the wires from the oscilloscope. We plug this end into channel one of the oscilloscope. Now, with the crock clips, we connect to the CD generator through the thicker wire. Now, here is the top of the CD with the magnets. We place it over the bolt of the bottom, making sure that it's free to rotate like so. Hi, so now that the CD generator is assembled, we need to prove that it works. So to prove that it works, we have to spin the magnets over the coils. As the magnets spin over the coils, this is what's making the electricity. So once we do that, we set up the oscilloscope to 500 millivolts is the voltage, and then the seconds is 250 milliseconds. As the magnets spin over the coils, it's clear to see that the voltage peaks are being made on the oscilloscope. 